¿Qué pasa, chavales? Bienvenidos al canal. Aquí estamos otra vez en Telltale Game of Thrones o Juego de Tronos. Con muchas ganas de seguir porque nos quedamos eh, con que Gareth de repente a Cotter le estaba atacando un caminante blanco y fuimos Silvi y Gareth eh, rapidísimo a la pelea de auxilio de, de Cotter. Y tengo ganas de ver lo que sigue porque también nos quedamos que Asher va a buscar asesinos entre los esclavos de Merín para llevárseles a ayudar a su a su familia y su tío, por lo que parece se va a quedar en en Merín con Daenerys para hacer una alianza eh, también nos hemos quedado que a Mira se, se la han llevado los soldados de de los Lannister y que a um, y que a Roderick eh, pues estaba con Elena Así que vamos a ver lo que pasa. This looks like the place. <laughs> This is definitely the place. So, who are we dealing with exactly? Pit fighters. Two go in, one comes out, day after day. No rules but kill. Anyone who can bueno. survive that is capable of anything. They're crazed savages. But one pit fighter is worth any ten cell swords. Eso sí que es verdad. If Son como you can convince them to fight for you, and that's not going to be easy. Don't expect to charm them or reason with them. If we're very lucky, we'll walk out with our heads. You were a pit fighter. If they're anything like you, we'll be just fine. Understand? They are nothing like me. These aren't soldiers. They're animals you unleash. <laughs> Mira el perrete que se lleva una mano. Con la bandera de los Targaryen. Must make you feel pretty good seeing the masters overthrown. They're not gone. They're just on their knees. And when they get back to their feet, they'll be more dangerous than ever. What? Yes! What the fuck? Trust me, you don't want to get involved, Asher. If he were, he'd have thrown 2,000 punches. Your friends have been busy. Let's hope our heads don't end up here. A tomar por culo. Oh, one last thing. They're not fond of strangers. Or anyone who shows weakness. Or fear. Or really any highborn pricks with lily white asses like you, little brother. Maybe they should see a familiar face first. <sighs> If they don't like us coming here uninvited, it will hardly matter. <laughs> We just want to talk to Amaya. You can, but not this one hiding behind your skirt. You've got to the count of three to turn around and walk away. One. <laughs> I like this one. <risa> Company. Mira, le hemos caído bien. Le hemos reventado la nariz de un cabezazo y le hemos caído bien. Qué de lujo. Is that a pit? Eh? Some masters couldn't get enough of the fighting, so they built their own private pits, where things could get really nasty. No nos separemos de Vespa. Sigue, sigue. No te separes de Vespa. Que nos dan un empujón y nos tiran para abajo. No, no, no. Abajo. 
qué patadón le ha, pe le ha pegado a ese hombre. That's Amaya. Keep your cock in your pants, little brother. She's likely to chop it off. Well, hello there. Not many people get past the beast. You must need something very badly. So, out with it. Before I decide not to let you leave. I've come with an offer. I think it's one that'll interest you and your men. If you wanted my interest, you wouldn't have shown up with her. Amaya, please. Please what? I had a friend once, the Basilisk, but she died a long time ago. I earned. So you advice. walk out on me. On all of us. Fighting <laughs> side by side, we were goddesses of the pits. But when you're born trash, I guess you can't help going back to the gutter. Enough! I didn't come to hear your bickering. So, what is it that you want? Why shouldn't we rip you to pieces and feed you to the beast? <laughs> My patience wears thin. My enemies mean to butcher my family in Westeros. They killed my father. They killed my little brother. And now I need great warriors to help me avenge their deaths and reclaim my home. You think we sell swords? We don't fight other people's wars. We are pit fighters. Artists who paint in blood. That was yesterday. The fighting pits have been closed. You're all free now! Free to do what you want! Don't you see that? Yes, we are free. Why would we follow another? We don't have masters anymore! Why would we follow anyone ever again? The life you've led here is over. I've met the Mother of Dragons. She won't open the pits again. If you want to fight, we offer gold and glory! Amaya, the way I left was terrible, I know. But we were friends once, and could be again. Please, set aside your anger and listen to him. Claro, claro, you want Amaya, to meet pit fighters? You have to earn their respect first. We don't know who you are until we see you bleed. <laughs> You're gonna have to show them you can fight. All right. Who? Who's the best you've got? His name is Bloodsong. He's vicious, fearless, and fast. Un chino. Oh, I've never seen him before. Take a good look there. He's the man who's going to kill your boy. We'll have to kill him. It'd be a shame to waste such a talented fighter. Perhaps if I just subdued him. No one has ever subdued him. Bueno, pues tendremos que ser los primeros. Well, suppose I better get this over with. So what are you supposed to be? With your little axe and your pretty blonde beard. I'd sooner Chino. bend you over to fuck than fight you. Thanks for noticing the beard. <laughs> well, come on! Let's see how you die! If I die in there... Yeah? You have a dying wish? This ought to be good. Will you return to Westeros and kill as many White Hills as you can? Nah. I'll drink enough ale to drown a horse. Hey! I need those! You'll fight with the weapons we give you. Bueno, a ver qué pasa. Hombre, esperemos que no muera Ashe. Me cae, me cae demasiado bien. 
He's come to order us to battle, like our masters did. I kill no man because another orders me to. I kill a man because it pleases me. Muy bien, chino. Let me show you how we dance in Marine. You fight dirty. I like that. Choose a weapon <laughs> and try not to die. Only one of you leaves the pit alive. May the best fighter win. The best would be me. Here, use this. Coño, es eso. Ahí está. La espada que llevaban los señores de los caballos, que ahora no me acuerdo cómo se llamaban. Hay que tener cuidado con el chino, ¿eh? Da mucha vuelta de tal, chino. Bueno, chavales, hemos pegado un pequeño corte porque he ido a esquivar un golpe y me ha matado directamente. O sea, no me ha dejado esquivar. Pero bueno. Ahora sí me dejo esquivar. ¿Estás listo, Wester Rossi? Esto va a matar. Ah, qué golpe me ha dado. Esto sería una muerte hermosa. ¿No es algo que te gustaría decir? ¿Ves eso, hombre? No podemos dejar que el crowd se vaya. Creo que no puedo, en realidad. A tomar por culo. Coño, chino, ¿qué te pasa? Dame eso. El mazo. Adiós robando y con el mazo dando. ¿Puede ayudar si estoy still? Maybe. Come on, pretty boy. Hey. Menuda patada que le he metido. Son of a whore. Qué buena arma. Esa puta mierda. Yo tengo un martillo. Wow. Me vas a quedar sin martillo, compañero. Cabezazo, dijo. Ah, eres una bestia. Es un triángulo de, de MMA. Vale, los huevos. Otra cosa no, pero tiene los huevos cuadrados de Ashe. Tú, Chinorri. Fuera. 
No sé, a lo mejor me ha retrasado, yo que sé, una milésima o dos milésimas de segundo y por eso no me ha salido, pero vamos. Your old champion is gone. As are your old masters. You can stay here in Marine with nothing, or you can come with me. I chose you for a reason. I offer you all a new life. You deserve better than this. You deserve more than to die for someone else's entertainment. Fight with me, and you will have glory and gold. If you've got the balls to follow me, we will set sail at dawn. And to those too craven to join me, to hell with you! Bueno, pues hemos salido de ahí victoriosos. Parece que vamos a tener un ejército. Uh. I knew them. What are those things? Oh, God. over here! Over here! Hostia, los caminantes blancos. Hay que quemarles. Cortale la cabeza. Ya verás como no. ¡Wow! La madre que la parió a esta. A chuparla. Esperemos que no. Por el bien de todos, eh. Uh, mucho movimiento está habiendo en este capítulo, eh. Joder, y ahora venimos aquí, que también esto va a ser el acabose. Cómo no. You're familiar with my brother's chambers, aren't you? Certainly you've been here before. You looked rather confused when you came in. No, Your Grace. No? I'm told you know these chambers as well as anyone. You're quite the curiosity, aren't you? You profess to be loyal to the Crown, yet you're not very loyal to Lady Marjorie. Have I displeased you, Your Grace? I've heard things. I understand you've been quite busy. Qué puta es, es que se entera de todo. Qué zorra. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? One can never tell with you northern girls. Assuming an honest person exists in King's Landing. I try to be, Your Grace. Hmm, I see. I've done my best to keep an open mind about people like you. Yet... Lucan tells me you invited yourself to Tommen's coronation party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. 
I meant no harm, Your Grace. I had a personal matter to attend to. A personal matter? I'm told you used another girl to talk your way in. You're not above using people to get what you want. Good. Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless, considering the consequences. My family is still very much at risk. Es que puta, es que da igual it was crucial I attend. Your family. Sometimes that's a convenient lie we tell ourselves. When I suspect your issue with Lord Andros played a part in it. You've been such a busy little handmaiden. I assume Lady Marjorie knew nothing of this. No, Your Grace. This wasn't the first time you've hidden the truth from her. A esta la da igual lo que le contestes porque siempre te vas a ir por el lado que a ella le convenga. Tell me the truth. Your secret is safe with me. I have in the past, but I won't anymore. You're a clever girl, aren't you? Perhaps I mistook your northern stubbornness for ignorance, but now I see there's more to you. You're a cunning girl, and perhaps you can help me. Your Grace? You're quite friendly with my brother Tyrion. I need you to speak with him before the trial begins. I want to know who he intends to call as a witness on his behalf. Consider it a favor to the crown, for which we will all be grateful. Uh, I, I guess I could, Your Grace. It won't be easy. Sí, uh, Tyrion is deep. I guess I eh? You'll have to hide your intentions, otherwise he'll tell you nothing. You may prove to be a useful little bird to me, assuming you do as you're told. In return, I'll take care of your problem with Lord Andros. Thank you, Your Grace. I never liked the man anyway. And I doubt anyone will miss him. Es que de esta sí que no me fío nada. Nada de nada. Porque esta es... Mira por su culo y a los demás que les den por saco. Mientras ella siga siendo la reina regente, da igual. Lo que pasa. No, no sé. 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 But you're my family, no matter what. I'd follow you anywhere, little brother. Claro que Just sí, try not to get us killed. Think we'd let you live without us, Westerosi? They say your homeland is fat and prosperous. An orchard ripe for plucking. We'll take what we want and kill anyone who stands in our way. Take anything not nailed down. Just not from my house. <laughs> that depends on how nice your house is. I'll show them that. Oh. Es una pena haber matado al Chinorri, porque si no lo wasn't exaggerating. Malcolm, you're here. And you found your soldiers. Anrath will be glad of your return. You came through for them. Just as I knew you would. What about you, uncle? Will you stay with the queen? If I can. I'd like to help her reclaim the Iron Throne. Imagine what an ally she'd be to House Forrester if she succeeds. Living here has made a better man of you, nephew. Perhaps the same will be true for me. Thank you, Uncle. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. You've guided me well. You are a son of Azure. For all your differences, he would be proud. I'll send a raven ahead to Ironrath to let Roderick know you sail for Westeros with uh, cell swords. My thoughts will be with you in the fight to come. Asher. Iron from ice. Iron from ice. How is he? Casting off! 
Bueno, Asher ya va para, ya, ya va para casa. Va para casa. Y llevamos unos cuantos luchadores bastante... Bastante apetecibles. He's a tricky little bastard. If he figures out who sent you, he'll tell you nothing. I'll be listening to every word you say. Ah, oh, I ask for brawn, they send me a handmaiden. Well, brawn, I just welcome in. Let me guess. Your family is in grave danger, and you've come seeking my help? Not that I'd be of much use to you. As you can see, I'm at a bit of a disadvantage. I thought we were friends, Lord Tyrion. I thought so as well. Yet, here you are. You brought wine. How thoughtful of you. And you <laughs> didn't even have to hide it. Doesn't smell poisoned. Poisoned? Cersei would love nothing more than to save herself the trouble of a trial. You don't expect me to drink alone, do you? They never let anyone in to see me. I suppose I'll have just a little. Ah, true girl of the north. <laughs> mm. Some things are worth dying for. A este yo no le quiero joder. So, why are you here? It's rather unusual for a handmaiden to visit the Black Cells. I've been worried about you, Lord Tyrion. Oh, have you? You may be the only person in all of King's Landing who doesn't want to see my head on a spike. You and Podrick. I have to admit, I've always admired your honesty. But I suspect there's more to you than one might imagine. This is all a ruse, isn't it? Sorry? You're coming here. We both know you have an ulterior motive. Es que... Que no es tonto, que es que este es el tío más inteligente que hay en todos los... Come to set los... me free. It's the perfect plan. No one would suspect it of you. I'm afraid not, unfortunately. Unfortunate for us both. So, tell me. Cersei sent you, didn't she? I know I'm not wrong. The truth, Mira. No more lies. I don't know what you're talking about. She didn't know such thing. The guards have never let anyone in with wine. That was your first mistake. Not that I don't appreciate the gesture. I wish you'd had yeah. the courage to tell me the truth. Not that I'm above drinking her wine. I told you to be careful. He'll twist your words. Stupid girl. You're acting a fool. Let me handle this. We're not done talking. You heard the girl. Go. Imp. What did my sister expect you would learn? Who will testify on your behalf? She's using you. And will continue to do so. Until you no longer prove useful. It's not as if I could refuse her. Cersei is not someone to be trifled with. And what would Lady Marjorie make of your new friendship with my sister? I doubt she'd be pleased. Assuming she doesn't dismiss you immediately. Lady Marjorie will understand. Cersei left me no choice. Let's hope she understands. Because absent her protection, you're in a very precarious position. <clears throat> what should I tell Cersei? You're a clever girl. I'm sure you'll think of something. Although, I would suggest you choose your words carefully. Cersei would be far less amused if she catches you in a lie. She'll have my head. She'd rather have mine. So, make something up. Tell her what she wants to hear. Enough of this nonsense. You're wasting my time. 
Out! Now! I wish you well, Lady Mira. Be careful who you trust. Es que es demasiado listo para que se intentes jugar a Tyrion. O sea, es que es boba de intentar jugársela a un tío que es más inteligente que todos los que hay en todo el mundo de, de Juego de Tronos. Sorry. Pues se la ha frungido. No means to wake you. You didn't sleep, did you? Neither did you. We haven't slept much at all these last few weeks. I... I hope you don't have any regrets. About this. About us. I've never felt more certain about anything. I'm glad. I wasn't sure of you. With all that's happened. What will we do now? Now that we're... Uh, what we are. We'll be married. And no one will be able to keep us apart. Not Griff, not his father, not Ramsay Snow. I was hoping you'd say that. Roderick? Oh! I'm sorry! I thought you were alone! Good morning, Talia. Hello, Elena. Oh! I, I didn't realize you two were... I mean, I didn't realize she was... It's all right, Talia. Come in. I really am sorry. It's just, this is urgent, Roderick. And... It's, it's all right. I can go. You two need to speak. I'll see you soon, I hope. Nos la hemos frugido repetidas veces. All right then, I'm listening. Last night I couldn't. I was having nightmares, so I. Go on, Talia. I went back there to the grove, and someone was there. What do you mean? Look. is a report how many fighting men we have where griff and the white hill garrison are being held it even talks about elena i know it's everything bueno pues ya sabemos quién i couldn't believe it if i hadn't seen it with my own eyes you said you saw someone who someone we trusted talia i need to know who it was He's like family, Roderick. But it doesn't matter. He's a traitor. He endangered our house. You have to deal with him like you would any other man. I'm sure he had his reasons. But no reason is good enough. It's your duty to tell me. And mine to pass judgment. Just promise me you'll kill him, Roderick. Anyone who would betray us like this deserves to die. I'm asking you, as your sister, Make him pay. I give you my word, Talia. The traitor will get what he deserves. Now, tell me. Come with me. He's in the Great Hall. Joder, ¿quién es? Va a ser Tuncan. Go get the guards. Va, sería un giro de guión si fuese la madre. Dice que no puede ser, pero sería algo que dirías, madre de la Virgen. Oh, my lord, you scared the bloody daylights out of me. 
What's that? You tell me. You don't scare me, Roderick. I've known you since you were a boy. Back when you still had a spine. You sold your loyalty. Like some whore in the street. My loyalty has always been to this house. But you've been too damn blind to see it. Now what I didn't see is that you were a traitor. You pushed me to this, Roderick. You brought it upon yourself. Don't you dare start making excuses. Excuses? Are you that naive? Look at you, Roderick. You're weak. You're weak. Just like Ethan was. Making Duncan his sentinel. Ethan was a boy. Ethan was a fool. And you've been making fool choices too since the day you crawled off that corpse cart. Bungling your betrothed hey, to Elena. Doesn't matter how either of you feel. Lord Glenmore will never let you marry her now. Letting Griff force you to the ground without a shred of dignity. Going to High Point without any soldiers, despite my every warning. Hell, you even managed to get Arthur killed. Enough, Roiland. You've had every opportunity to save this family, but you've squandered them all. Your father would be ashamed. Hate me for it, but it's the bloody truth. So you turn your cloak. That's your answer. I'm not gonna stand by and watch you destroy this family. Qué hijo de puta, qué de You're mierda. driving House Forrester the way of the Starks. The only thing that matters is that you swore an oath to Walter. I swore to your father. I'd swear to Asher if he were here. But you're a cripple who can barely hold a sword. Asher knows how to act. Asher would cut your traitor heart out. Oh, I don't doubt it. He has more balls than you ever will. Roderick, it's Griff. He's gone. Somebody set him free. Was this your doing? They were going to ambush you at the trade. I just saved your life. But Ryan... Ryan... How could you? This was his doing! Just sentence me and be done with it. Roderick, you promised. Kill me. And Asher dies too. A tomar por culo, por traidor. It was the right thing. Bueno, yo había dicho lo de la madre porque sería el golpe más gordo que podría haber. Sabía que no. We have to warn Asher. We can't, not if he's at sea. The Lord. What do we do? Prepare the horses. We're gonna defend my brother. Oh, 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 oh. You smell that? We're almost there. Let's go. Let's have a look. Come on, break it up. Save your love making for below deck. They listen to you. Barely. But what happens if your lord brother decides he's the one in charge once we're at Iron Rap? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Or will it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A lord sounds an awful lot like a master. Doesn't matter if Roderick's lord of our house. These are my soldiers to lead. Oh, you may want to start by telling them your brother's not to be harmed. He hasn't had a chance to win them over like you have. Hmm. Point taken. No jodas, que llegan y se cargan al se cargan al hermano, That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. 
Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. Could be. Or could be we'll have a fight on our hands. I'll let the others know. Brother. Right. Oh, this couldn't be easy, could it? Sí que tienes razón, podría ser un poquito más fácil esto. So, this is Westeros. Ugly and small. Fucking freezing, too. I said you'd be paid. I never said you'd be warm. Asher, thank the gods you've made it back. Good to see you, my lord. Hope you're ready for a fight. Lord's got something planned. I don't know what yet, but it won't be good. Been stuck on a boat for weeks. Can use a good fight. What? Get that gate open! Asha, no! It's been a while since I've been any White Hills. Oh, pues mira, ya lleva su... No, 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 a bestia que no lo mate, no jodas. Joder, pues sí que empezamos bien.
Bueno, chavales, pues hemos acabado este episodio, que ha sido más cortito de lo normal, ahí veis. Tú y el 63,4% de los jugadores no intentaron apuñalar a Ramsey Snow. Tú y el 63% de los jugadores no le dijeron a Tyron que Cersei los había enviado. Tú y el 58% de los jugadores decidieron ejecutar el traidor. Y tú y el 60,5% de los jugadores ordenaron a Rodrik que se quedara atrás. Pues bueno chicos, dar like si queréis, suscribiros al canal si no estáis suscritos y compartir los vídeos también si queréis. Espero que os haya gustado el vídeo, espero que os esté encantando la serie. Una putada muy grande haber perdido a Rodrik, eh, porque me caía bastante bien además. Elena se va a quedar destrozada, así que nada, pues ya lo siguiente es que si queréis seguirme en tu trabajo en la descripción lo tenéis y si queréis comentarme adelante que siempre serán bienvenidos vuestros comentarios. Y nada, pues ya deciros que nos vemos en el siguiente vídeo, que este ha sido un poquito más largo de lo normal. Y nada, ya solo queda despedirme y deciros adiós, adiós chicos.